Have you ever gone on a Sunday afternoon cruise with your family? But your suspension is just way too stiff. So now you have to yell at your mechanic? Worry no longer. With BC Racing's Dampening Adjuster Extenders, you can adjust the dampening on your shocks hassle-free to keep the family happy and riding comfortably. 1-800-BC-RACING. What's up? All right, here we go, guys, real quick. To preface this, so we're gonna go to LZ's Invitational. From there, we were gonna come back down and hit Hyperfest, but at the same time, Holly LS Fest Texas is happening, and yeah, just we're in our own backyard. A lot of good people coming through pre-meets and things. So we were gonna miss this for Hyperfest, although we had a change of heart. So now we're gonna call Swan from Holly and let him know that we changed our mind and we're gonna be at the Holly LS Fest, May 19th and 20th. Let's see what he says. What's up, bro? Swan, what you doing, dude? About to go on an airplane. Oh, nice, nice. Where are you headed? Uh, Vegas for LS Fest. Oh, damn, dude, it's on like that. Yeah, dude, we are in it. That's awesome, dude, that's awesome. Well, listen, Swan, what if I had a change of heart? You know what I mean? And like, I'll compete, I'll rep, and I'll be there. You know it's gonna make me happier than anything, but I don't wanna sway you. I want you to do what you wanna do, and I want you to be where you wanna be. Well, I wanna be in my own backyard. I want our pre-meet to be rad. I wanna kick everyone's ass and drift with you guys, man. Let's do Holly LS Fest. You got a spot, brother. Let's do it. Man, yes. <laughs> All right, May 19th, May 19th, 20th, I'll be there. I'm going to go to the LZ Invitational, I'll come home, we'll gear up, and we'll be ready for you to roll into town. I'll be, I'll be, at, uh, I'll be in Jersey with you, brother. Okay, sick, sick. So I'll see you again back-to-back -back weekends, dude. That's it, dude. This is a good year. We're, we're, we're off to a good start. That's right. All right, dude, we're going to party. I'm stoked, man. Thank you for the call, dude. This for real just made my day. I'm so pumped. I got you, Nick. Love you, man. All right, bro. Love All right, you too. bye. All right, there it is. May 19th, 20th, Holly LS Fest, Texas, in our backyard. If you missed us at Fuel Fest, come out. Let's cruise. We're going to compete. So this one will be us running the Formula Drift layout, going fast as fuck, and running doors. So this one will be much more aggressive. Yeah, see you guys there. Yeah, welcome back to a new episode here, 144 Sprint House and Race Studio. For those who are just tuning in, uh, we're like a creative shop that prints and drifts. You're probably finding this video because you want to know about the JZX90, which is what this video is all about. So me and Adrian are about to open up this box that we got from FDF. This should be everything we need for the front and rear of the Any Mantis. What's it called, Adrian? Mild. Mild Mantis. So for those who don't know, I'm a dad who's trying to keep my four door from going too sideways. We are upgrading everything with the FDF kit. So welcome to this video. I'm losing it, Adrian. What do you got to say? We just got to install some uh, angle kit stuff and adjust and make it look cooler. That's right, that's right. So yeah, let's do this thing. I'm gonna hand this camera to Tito. I'm gonna eat my lunch and watch Adrian unbox this thing. Watching the video, this is how the knuckle adapter works. The knuckle bolts to this. So, car's rear steer, so the tie rods are in the back. This is to the coilover, so the coilover mounts here. And tie rod ends go back here, like that. That bolts to your OEM tie rod. This is your upper, so it goes like that. This goes somewhere like that. Quick disclaimer too on the intro video, that was for fun, for BC racing. We stayed in our complex, Andy never really hit the road, so for the moms and dads out there that understand that Recaro seat's a little bit too big for him, uh, I hear you and I promise it was all safe and on private roads. Rear's always easier. Just three arms. One, two, three. And then we'll get boogie in on this front. On the rear arm next week. 17? Yeah. The front of the bolt is 19. So, yeah. 
Just keep your bolts together. Okay. Yeah, we're on that. What, this? No. <laughs> Hey bud, eyes are up here. <laughs> the joy of adjustable wrenches. All right, so here we're going to measure and get it as close as possible to the OEM length. So yeah, I was chatting with Adrian, day one, JZX90 is on the lift. They're starting to take everything apart, of course. You guys are seeing all that happen. But yeah, Adrian, hit me with some updates, dude. Like, how'd it go? I got all the arms off except for this one. This one is, obviously you can see it's like free of anything, but it still won't get out. So we're soaking it in PB overnight because it's pretty rusty. And hopefully that just pops out in the morning. But that's the last arm. Uh, I have the rest of the arms over there and we're gonna size them as close to OEM as possible get them on the car and then we'll play with camber and all that once it's on and then we can see what fitment you want and if you want to lower the car more and stuff Sick. like that so all in a day's work now tomorrow back at it yeah tomorrow Sick. we'll do finish up the rear we'll start on the front hopefully we can finish the front and then got to order a little alignment kit to get us started that way we don't have to go find an alignment shop we're gonna try to do an in-house alignment on this that will then double for the race car track side once we get the arms done we'll start doing the uh, rear main seal we'll do the oh, steering rack did you see this oh, thing dude yeah got some shit leaking man Gross. yep sick all right day two coming up let's keep the thing rolling rusty things these are very gross and rusted and they're not doing very well plus Technically, we don't need this. It's an eccentric bolt that goes to the subframe and basically lets the alignment of these arms do whatever they need to because they're not adjustable. But we're switching to adjustable arms so we can adjust with this versus this. And these move over time, so they're not really the best. So I'm talking to Josiah on getting these made, but they're called lockouts. I have some for the bed. Basically, they're these big squares and they hold them in place where the subframe would go yeah. so they can't move. Just doing some measuring so Josiah can make us some for this car and then we can throw whatever bolt he's about to break on. Oh, and there it goes. <laughs> you guys moving on? Yeah, because that thing's. I'm about to torch it. One eternity later. So the knuckle will mount here. You're right. So it looks, it looks like it. It's working. Oh, angle kit. Oh yeah, I do. Any shots? Yeah. Listen, man, I missed this whole vlog. How was it, Tito? Good. Was it good? I think. I mean, we got the FDF on the car. Me and Adrian are just conversating about the front over fenders, the ride height, the clearance of the wheels. It looks like I'm, I'm shopping for front fenders and wheels right now. I think uh, the install went smooth, right? How was the behind the scenes? I missed the whole thing. How is it, Adrian? He's busy. Yeah. Hope y'all enjoyed this video. JZX90 is making progress. Front fenders, wheels. Drop some comments on what wheels we should get, because now I got to buy some. So that's kind of fun. Don't put in the comments RPF ones, you know what I mean? All right, boys. See y'all later. Someone opened my skateboard and I'm sad. I said, I told the team, I got this board coming in. They were like, you know, we'll figure that out. But I said, don't open it. Look, look at this. I walk in, it's open. there's no surprise now. Just playing. Let's see what we got. Sorry for the Jess up. Hey, they hooked it up with some grip tape, dude. Yeah. What's in this, Caden? Caden's the one who opened the box. <laughs> I already admitted to it. 
Oh, a lot of stickers. Good. A fair amount. Dude, they're getting better at the sticker game. They got the. Yeah, those are, those those are sick. Oh, sick. I wish I had those. Videos. Got some hardware, dude. Damn. They're out here building a whole deck, dude. Yeah, those are cool. What size are those? Mini logos. 51 mils. Dude, sick. All right, let's see what deck we got. Huh. Okay, okay. Woo! All right. I feel like feels pretty good. Feels like uh, it's got a pretty steep nose. I think it's an eight two five. Where's Mario, the, where you at, dude? Where's the deck? Yeah, dude. Yeah, deck is down here. Uh, now we got to play a game of skate. You said it. Boss's orders, man. 